Hey guys, today we talk about the Air Jordan 1 Low Swooshless in the Arctic Orange colorway. Tune in! Hey guys, welcome to Casa Station where we talk sneakers. My name is Zoe, and if you're here for the first time, make sure you hit that subscribe button and even that notification bell so you don't miss any dope sneaker content. What you've all been waiting for, the Air Jordan 1 Low Swooshless in the Arctic Orange colorway. Man, oh man, I, I definitely have an obsession with these Air Jordan 1 Lows that are swooshless. Um, it's mainly because of the quality associated with them. But anyways guys, let's get straight up into the review. So looking at the sneaker, you'll notice that on the top upper portion of the shoe, it's made up of a really nice tumbled leather, which again, attracts me very much to this sneaker. In addition to that, you'll see that it has a pink or what Nike is calling an Arctic orange colorway, but definitely looks like pink, Pepto-Bismol pink, um, if I do say so myself, when it comes to the sneaker colorway. You'll see that the shoelaces are a waxed shoelace and in addition to that they have some gold colored tips. The midsole and the outsole of the sneaker are made up of a white synthetic rubber and they go well with the pink upper of the sneaker in general. So a special feature of this Nike sneaker is that it is swooshless, meaning that you don't usually see or you won't see the Nike swoosh on the side uh, panels of the sneaker, but you will see embossing of the Air Jordan brand at the back and the Nike Air on the top of the tongue of the sneaker, which is a cool touch. I think this is a dope summer sneaker to rock. I have Arctic orange colored dunks, which I'm definitely rocking this summer, and I was glad to pick these guys up from the Nike employee store. Pricing wise, these sneakers ran for $150 when they came out last year. I'm not sure if they're available anywhere anymore. I was fortunate enough to get them from the Nike employee store for 75 bucks. And you know, I was looking for these sneakers because I'm, I feel like I'm almost obsessed with them because I have like three pairs behind me as you can see, plus this one will make it four because they're just so versatile and I can wear them with anything. And they're minimal and they don't have, you know, Nike stamped all over them. In regards to size for this Air Jordan 1 swooshless low, I would suggest going true to size. So my sneaker talk is up for today guys. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe, and even hit that notification button if I treated you well during this video. But anyways guys, I'll see you all on the next episode of Casa Station, deuces.